Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to uh, factor um, this expression. Um, and this is a trinomial. And one of the ways that we can learn how to factor a trinomial is what we call the diamond method. Um, but to understand the diamond method, we pretty much have to understand, though, what is standard form. And standard form or a quadratic could be written as ay squared plus by plus c. OK? So when going ahead and factoring this using the diamond method, pretty much what we do is create an x. Um, which really could be a diamond. I don't actually like doing a diamond, but here we go. There's a diamond. Um, I actually just like using the x method, but it's called the diamond method. So anyways, what we want to do um, when determining, you know, trying to factor using the diamond method, pretty much what we need to do is identify two factors that are going to multiply to give us c, but then add to give us our value b. So we write b, which is negative 7 up top. And then we write our c, which is negative 18 on the bottom. So again, I wrote the dot to represent the product and the plus sign to represent the sum. So two numbers that multiply to give us c, but then add to give us b. So therefore, I pretty much just take my factors of negative 18. Now remember, negative 18, one factor has to be negative. One factor is going to have to be positive, right? It has to be one or the other. So I'm just going to label the factors. Forget about them being positive or negative for the, at the moment. So I'll start from 18 times 1. 6 times 3, 9 times 2. And those are going to be all the factors uh, for 18. Now, all I simply need to do is say, all right, well, which one positive, you know, which one of one's positive, one's negative, one's negative, one's positive, that I can add to give me negative 7? Because they all multiply to give me 18, right? Or if one's negative, to multiply to give me negative 18. But which one of them, if one's negative, one's positive, would add to give me negative 7? Well, if I have a negative 9 and a positive 2, that will work. So I just write negative 9 here and positive 2 there. Now, those are going to be my two, um, two values for my factors, which I, I can now write as y minus 9 times y plus 2. And we take these two values and write them in our factors when we have um, when a is equal to 1 and we're trying to factor. So therefore, we have now written our uh, trinomial as a product of its two factors. Thanks.